Welcome to Electron Online. In this video, we're going to take a look and see what a linear homogeneous second order differential equation looks like. Wow, that's a mouthful, isn't it? Well, we already know what a second order differential equation is. It's an equation that includes a y double prime, the second derivative of the function. It also can include the first derivative of the function, and then includes the function itself, and then it's usually set equal to some function of x. Now notice, to make that into a homogeneous equation, we just simply set it equal to zero. So instead of setting equal to a function of x, we set it equal to zero. This alone makes it what we call a homogeneous second order differential equation, and it's a linear equation because it has the terms y double prime, y prime, and y in it, and it does not have a product of either the second derivative times y or the first derivative times y, because that would make it nonlinear. So here are three examples of what we call second order linear homogeneous differential equations. So the first one here, you say, well, wait a minute. Don't you have an x squared in front of the y prime? Does that exclude it from being a linear equation? Well, it turns out no, because we can divide both sides of the equation by an x, x squared. And if we do that, this equation then becomes y double prime plus 1 over x times y prime plus 1 times y equals 0. And this is obviously a linear second order homogeneous differential equation. That one here, notice there's a term missing. The y prime term is missing. So really what this, what this means is that this is equal to y double prime plus 0 times y prime plus some constant times y equals 0. Again, since it's set equal to 0, it's called a homogeneous equation. It's a second order differential equation. And yes, it's linear, even though the middle term, the y prime term is missing, this is still considered to be a linear second order homogeneous differential equation. And of course, here's a typical example of what that may look like. It's a linear equation. It has the y double prime, the y prime, and the y, three terms right there. It's homogeneous because it's set equal to zero. It's linear, second order. So we call it a linear second order uh, homogeneous differential equation. I'm not quite sure if I put that in the right order or not, but at least we know what it is. So it's a second order differential equation. It's homogeneous and it's linear, all in one. That's a, and that's, uh, here's three nice examples of what that looks like. 